YouTube. It's Megan. It's 7 in the morning and this is me coming off a night shift. I'm actually doing this vlog because I'm so tired that I'm worried I'm going to fall asleep at the wheel. So talking to myself might actually help me stay awake. Um, but if you didn't know, I'm a nurse and um, I just went to 12 hour night shift. Um, which wouldn't be so bad if I hadn't been up since 9 o'clock yesterday. So I've pretty much gone almost 24 hours um, without any sleep, but that is the nature of my job. I'm casual, so they call me and I go. And work has been slow lately, so I gotta go when they call. But it was a good shift. Nothing too uh, overwhelming or exciting happened on my team, and so fairly quiet night. Um, my giveaway winners were picked and announced, so I've heard from one of the winners and still waiting to hear from the other one. And once I hear from him, those prizes will be sent out. If I don't hear from the other winner by Friday, then I will pick a new winner, like I promised. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys like that giveaway. Um, I'm sorry most of my giveaways are iPhone 4 cases because that's what I have, but I do have several headphone reviews coming up and I plan on um, giving those away um, once I'm done reviewing them, so look forward to that. It's going to be a beautiful day, unfortunately I'm going to sleep for several hours of that. I'll go to bed probably by about 8 and uh, I'll get up at about 2 this afternoon and then I have um, some swimming to do. Um, with one of my special needs clients that I work with and then I have football practice and then a couple of friends of mine are coming over on the ferry tonight and um, spending a couple days at my place so that should be pretty sweet to have some company and uh, I'll probably go to the pub, watch some movies, you know, the kind of things that friends do. Look at that beautiful sunlight on my face. So yeah, Hopefully I don't sound like I'm intoxicated or anything because they say that nurses coming off night shift are more dangerous than intoxicated drivers. And we are almost worse than intoxicated drivers. I have friends that have driven through red lights, um, they get home and they don't remember even driving home. I'm not that bad, but I am pretty tired. So I'm going to go to bed in the daytime. And uh, I will catch you guys later. Cheers.